Just start by getting warmed up, start rolling the shoulders right the way back, just little circles going backwards. And then take the arms the opposite way, little circles going forwards. Taking the arms right the way back, big circles going backwards. Quite a fast movement, get the shoulders warmed up. And then take them the opposite way, big circles going forwards. Swinging the arms up, letting them fall down. And then from there, hands together out to the side. One arm up, one arm down, same. The opposite way, nice good stretch across the chest, stretch across the shoulders. And then from there, hands to the side, drop down, try and get the hands down to the knee, past the knee if you can. As you're doing them, try and bring the elbow nice and high, so we're stretching into the lats. Nice and high with the elbow. And then hands onto the hips, into hip circles. Big circles one way, all the way forward, all the way back. And then swap, change direction. And then from there, hands together, abs nice and tight, just rotate side to side, keep squeezing and tensing the core as you rotate. From the knee, rotate over the shoulder. Deep breath on the way down, breathe out as we, as we rotate. Swap sides. And then from there, through the legs, over the shoulder, through the legs, over the opposite shoulder. Deep breath on the way down, breathe out as, the, as you rotate. Each time try and go a little bit deeper on the squat, a little more power as you lift, so getting that heart rate up. And then from there, Feet hip to shoulder width, squat down nice and low. Bring the leg right the way around. Same on the opposite side. Just start to open the hips. Then each time a little bit lower on the squat. A little bit higher as you bring the leg round. And then from there, keeping your body tall. Squat down nice and low, chest lifted, hold onto the toes, lock out the top, hold for a couple of seconds, drop back down so as low as we can, up as high as we can, stretching your hamstrings, stretching the lower back, let's keep them going. So each time, try and go that little bit deeper, chest lifted. Lock out at the top, couple of reps. And then from there, opposite, hand to foot. Legs nice and straight. So we're dynamically stretching the hamstrings, the lower back. Getting our body prepared, ready for our main workout. A little bit more dynamic to add. A little skip on the end as well. And the last. So this first round in the start with heel kicks, hands onto your bum. Try those heels right the way up to the hands. Let's get ready. Straight in.
Next one, feet together, hands together, abs nice and tight. Try to get those hands above the head into star jumps. Three, two, one. Straight in. Shoulder width apart. Try and go at least upper leg parallel to the floor. Into squats. Let's get ready. Let's get set up. Three, two, one. Oh, here we go. Hands together, hands in line with the mid chest, draw the belly button towards the spine, into seal jumps. Try and keep those hands in line with your mid chest. Right, here we go. Together. Bring the elbow right the way back, squeeze the shoulder blades, pushing the arms up towards the sky into shoulder press jumps. one into high knees so knees in line with the hips driving those arms three two one straight in some water on board and then we're going to our first round. So this first round we're going to start with star jumps, feet together, hands together, count the reps, see what you can get out. 20 seconds, a 10 second rest. We're going to go full plank position, so onto your hands, hands underneath your shoulders and then from there it's going to be touch, touch, try and squeeze and tense the stomach throughout so I'm not rotating my body, I'm not rotating, I'm keeping that body fixed. Left hand to right shoulder, right hand to left shoulder. Let's get ready in position. So star jumps go, first of all, back. count the reps. Four, three, two, one, go. Here we go. Remember your score, into full plank position. So hands under the shoulders, remember left hand to right shoulder, right hand to left shoulder. Well, here we go. Tense and squeeze the core throughout. Try and keep those hips fixed. Remember the score on the star jumps. Let's try and beat it. at least one more. In position. Remember the score, we're going to go back in, plank, shoulder touch, in position. Two 
down, two to go back in to star jumps. Let's try and beat that score. Three, two, one, go! Back in, shoulder touch, in position. Away we go. Whatever the high score is, let's try and beat it. Okay, last time onto the plank shoulder touch. Let's get set back up in position. Away we go. And relax, just get that water back on board. So this next round, you're going to start with seal jumps, feet together, hands together, hands in line of the mid chest, draw the belly button towards the spine, again count the reps, see what you can get out in the 20 seconds. That's your first exercise, your second exercise, you're going to go back to your mats, hands, same position as the last round, hands under your shoulders, abs nice and tight, squeeze and hold, squeeze and hold. So you're going to go renegade row, try and bring that elbow nice and high, keeping the body fixed. Let's get ready, let's get in position. Seal jumps first, count the reps. Away we go. Remember you score into renegade rules. Let's get ready. Straight in, squeeze. So try and get the elbow past the rib. Keep that body nice and straight. You can get a press up in, get a press up in, go for the level that's gonna challenge you. So remember the score on the seal jumps, let's try and beat it. Feet together, hands together, abs tight. Straight in. Keep counting those reps. Remember your score. Back in. Renegade rows. Let's get in position. Hands on those shoulders. Straight in. Elbow past that rib. Back in the seal jumps. So have that number in your head you got last time. Let's try and beat it. Renegade rows. 
position, hands under our shoulders. Straight in. Whatever that high score is, let's try and beat it. Straight in. Okay, last time. Onto the Renegade rows, then we rest it. In position. Take that rest, get that water back on board. So this next round, we're gonna start with squats. So it's gonna be feet, hip to shoulder width, trying to get at least upper leg parallel to the floor. If you can go lower, then go lower on them without lifting the heels up, so as low as you can think about the range of movement on them. That's your first exercise. The second one, we're gonna be on your hands. Just bring your feet in a little bit, so you're into this position here. You're gonna lift your one arm, so, and then you'll take your opposite leg through. So you'll lift your arm, take the leg through, Heel, lift your toes back, lift your arm, take leg through. So that's the easier version, harder version. If you can get them out, press up, rotate, press up, rotate. Let's get ready, let's get in position. So starting with squats first of all, feet hip to shoulder width, let's get ready. In position, straight in, first round. In position, so remember hands under the shoulders. So we're taking, lifting the hand, we're taking the foot through, lead with the heel, back, lift the hand, rotate. Away we go. Harder version, we add the push up. Back in to squats, let's get ready. Straight in. Okay, use that 10 seconds. Get back in position. So we lift the hand, come through, lift the hand, come through. In position. Straight in, first round. Let's get the set back up. In position, so remember. We lift the hand, take the leg through, lift the hand, take the leg through, opposite side. Three, two, one. 
once more on each. Back into squats. Three, two, one. Here we go. Okay, back in the rotations. Let's get set back in position. Take that rest, get that water back on board. So this next round, we're going to start with skaters. So you're going to start one side of your mat, one leg, bend the legs, you load in, push over, and then push back. So you're always onto one leg. So I'm not just going side to side, I'm loading, pushing, loading, pushing back. That's your first exercise. Your second one, you're going to go side plank. So it's going to be elbow underneath the shoulder. Easier version, cross the leg over, hand to the floor, and then lift up. Harder, lift the arm. Harder still, foot on top of the other foot, or even foot to the side, okay? So side plank, then we repeat, then we'll go the same on the opposite side. Let's get ready, let's get in position. So skaters first, one leg, sit the hips back, load the leg, away we go, push over, push over. Drive those arms as well, so as you push, you're pushing the leg, you're pushing the arms over as well, getting the core working, getting the upper body working. So side plank, so right side first, right arm towards the floor, elbow underneath the shoulder, go to the level that's going to challenge you, lift those hips nice and high. And push your arm towards the sky or towards the ceiling. Three, two, one, so back in to your skaters. Let's get ready. Onto that one leg. Straight in. Push over. Power. Load up the one leg. This time, opposite side. So we're going to go left side, left arm, left elbow underneath the shoulder. Push your right arm towards the sky. Away we go. Lift those hips nice and high. Push the fingertips right the way up. Back in to skaters. In position. Three, two, one. Here we go. go. Okay, back in right side. Plank. Use that 10 seconds to get set up. Straight it. Back in to your skaters. Let's get ready in position. Straight in, power. Try to push off that leg.
Last time, the left side. Plank. Let's get set up. Three, two, one. Straight back in. And relax, just take that rest. Then we're moving on to our next round. This next round, you're going to start with four shuffles. So it's going to be one, two, three, four. Squat and then swap legs. Four. Squat as many times as you can in the 20 seconds. And then I'm going to superset that one with it's going to be a sit up. So hands to the side of the head. Try to come all the way up, elbows to knees. Once you come down, bring your heels in, feet in. Lift your hips nice and high, glute reach. So one sit up one glute bridge as many times as we can. So shuffles and squat first. Let's get ready in position. Remember four shuffles, squat first, in position. Let's get ready. Position gap between the chin and the chest. Let's get ready. One sit up first. Three, two, Shuffles and squat. Three, two, one. Straight in. Go. Okay, back in last time. Sit up the bridge. Last time on the Gap between the chin and the chest. Three, two, one. Straight in. Three, two, one. Chill. 
just take that rest and then we'll move on to our next round. So this next round you're going to start with shoulder press, jump feet together and your arms back, squeeze your shoulder blades, abs nice and tight, push your arms up towards the sky, count the reps, see what you can get out in the 20 seconds, 10 seconds rest your second exercise, you're going to be back into hands underneath the shoulders, easier version, from here you're going to sit right way right back, try and touch your toe and then the same on the opposite side, so that's the easier version. If you want to go harder, press up, reach back, press up, reach back. Try and touch the opposite foot. So let's get ready, let's get in position. Shoulder press, jumps first, count the reps. Three, two, one. Pushbacks, it's going to be the easier version. Touch, back, touch, back, harder person. Put the press up in. Away we go. Remember the score on the shoulder press jumps. Try and get at least one more in position. Away we go. Okay, so remember. That score, we're going to go back to reach backs in position. Straight in. Jumps. Have that number in your head that we need to get. Three, two, one, two. Okay, back into your reach backs. Let's get ready in position. Straight in. Take that rest. So we're going to our next round. So this next round, you're going to need two markers, anything just to put down onto the floor, and then space them out to about a meter apart. You're going to stand at the side of them. We're going to do figure eight sideways. So it's going to be round the one, and then round 
the other one. Again, count the reps. See what you can get out in the 20 seconds. That's your first exercise. And then your second exercise, we're gonna go same position as what we did before. So it's gonna be a plank position onto your hands. But this time, we're gonna take the arm out, squeeze the shoulder blade, bring it back, squeeze the shoulder blade. So I'm not just lifting the arm, I'm lifting, squeezing, lifting, squeezing, keeping the hips fixed all the way through. So run arounds first. Let's get ready, let's get in position. Are you ready? So counting the reps. Remember sideways round. Four, three, two, one. Oh, here we go. So through and through, that's one. See what you can get out in that 20 seconds. Remember your score. So the next one, we're gonna go hands under the shoulders. So remember we're lifting and squeeze. Lift and squeeze. Squeeze. So I'm not just lifting the arm, I'm squeezing the shoulder blade, squeezing the abs. Remember the score, try and go opposite way this time. Straight in. Opposite way round. Back in. So plank front raise. Oh, here we go, straight in. So go back in. Opposite way on the cones. Straight in. Back in. Plank. Front raise. In position. Each opposite way. Three, two, one. Straight in. Okay, last time. Onto that front raise. Straight it. Squeeze and hold at the top. Next round is going to go opposite arm to leg lift. So this last round you're going to start hands underneath the shoulders. From there it's going to be left arm, right leg, bring them together, squeeze and hold, and then all the way out. All the way in, all the way out. 20 seconds on the one side, 20 seconds on the other side. Let's get ready in position. So left arm, right leg, all the way in, all the way out. As you lift, 
squeeze the lower back, squeeze your shoulder blade. So you're working on your posterior chain, you're working on your core muscles. Opposite side, so this time, right arm, left leg, in position. All the way in, all the way out. Deep breath, breathe out, release. seconds you're going back in left arm right leg straight in Right arm, left leg, let's get ready, let's get in position. Okay, this next one, line down, so it's gonna be up and then back down. Up, back down, let's get ready. Away we go. Deep breath on the way down, breathe out as we lift. Okay, last one, hands underneath, from there, underneath the chest, you're lifting, and then sitting back. Lift, sit back, just keep repeating that pattern. Just trying to get your, your bum anti heels. Lift nice and high on that back extension. So from there, we're just going through your stretches. So first one, just clasping the hands, drop the chin down, push your arms forward, get a nice good stretch across the upper back. Start to get that breathing. Taking the arms right the way back, squeeze the shoulder blades to open the chest out. And then from there, arms above the head, lean the body to one side, stretch into your lats. Back to center, over to the other side. And then back to centre, bring your arm across. Easy arm across into a shoulder stretch. And then swap sides. Same on the opposite side. Take the arm right way back. Grab the elbow, pull the elbow back into a tricep stretch. Keep getting that breathing. Swap side, same on the opposite side. And then from there, slight bend in the legs. Bring your leg up, grab the foot, stretch into the front of the legs, stretch into your quads, coming the leg back as so you stretch into the hip flexors as well. And then swap sides, same on the opposite side. And then from there, heel to the floor, lift the toes, sit right way back, stretch into the back of the legs, stretch into your hamstrings. Swap sides. Same on the opposite side. Legs wide, drop the hips back, push the legs apart into an inner thigh stretch. And then from there, cross the leg over the other leg, sit back on the leg you're standing on, into a glute stretch. And we try to sit back in, that stretch feeling into the glutes. Swap sides, same onto the opposite side.
and then from there take the leg right way back push your heel into the floor into a calf stretch swap side same on the opposite side and then from there just shake your legs bounce your shoulders shake them give yourselves a clap well done and i'll see you all for your next workout